UFC 281, doing a quick prediction today. I'm going to try to get it under five minutes. Um, Adesanya versus Pereira. I feel like Adesanya is going to take him. I feel Adesanya has the experience. We're not in the old promotions now with the kickboxing. Adesanya's experience, momentum, his all-round technical prowess since that first, those earlier fights. He's just going to be levels above, I feel, um, Pereira. He's not fighting the same guy. Adesanya's not fighting the same guy, but given the growth of both, I would say Adesanya has the tools and the IQ in the octagon to dispose of Pereira. That's what I feel. It's going to take a lot of mistakes from Adesanya to get knocked out in this fight, especially since he's been knocked out by this guy before. The growing and the experience, I just feel like, it sort of reminds me of um, Rampage Jackson versus Vandalay Silva, where Jackson had beat him twice in pride. Totally different in this fight, I feel like. Adesanya is... Um, and then, obviously, Jackson lost to um, Silva twice in pride, and then he beat him. Different organisation, different sort of fight rules, different usage of, you know, obviously, kickboxing instead of all-round, you know, leg kicks and more wrestling involved and the whole just the negation of space i feel like adesanya has got this i don't see him losing to anyone ever again peace famous last words zhang versus espraza i'm going with espraza because i feel like zhang really has lost a mojo as well as a hair so yeah i'm going with um espraza on that not a fight i'm too keen on but yeah i'm going with espraza and Chandler versus Poirier. Said it once, I'll say it again. Poirier. Chandler is the nearly man in a lot of fights. Always gives the greatest fights. But Poirier is a dog. Um, and if you want a dirty box with Poirier, unless, unless Poirier just lost his hunger and not focused, Chandler's coming, but Chandler's a pit bull that once you can tame after a round, as most fighters find out, you've got him. He keeps coming. But he's never the same after that first shot. Once that first shot lands and Poirier feels it and weathers it, if he does, I feel like Poirier will outbox him. Dirty boxing. He's just got a better IQ. He's a little bit more patient and he's just tougher and more durable all around. I feel like he's only lost to Oliveira, his key, in a while. Um, no shame losing to Khabib. He's not been the same since, but it doesn't matter. Poirier and Chandler, I don't think either are really special. But if one, I would have to edge Poirier on not only the size factor, just the doggedness, just the durability um, and the, the ability to mix it up. Unless Chandler can utilise the wrestling, which could be key, I feel like Poirier has just got too much dogged experience for Chandler. Where if you want to go to war, a five round will suit Poirier more, I feel. Chandler's got to knock him out. If Chandler doesn't, which he probably won't, he'll probably rock him. Chandler never seems to finish fights, apart from Tony Ferguson. That aside, that was a great kick. But I don't see him doing that with a Poirier. I do not see him knocking Poirier out. Again, famous last words. I feel like Poirier is just going to be too much dirty boxing, too much um, ruggedness in there. Too, too skilled and too smart and too patient and too big. Um, so definitely Dustin Poirier for the win. Adesanya for the win. And a win for Espraza. Yeah, I'm going with all the favourites, possibly. I am 140. I'm 26 on fight predictions. That means I've got 140 right. That is what it means. I'm 26 wrong. Yeah. When people say, what does it mean? Well, it means 140 right, 26 wrong. Check the profile. Uh, it's all in there. I'm going with Poirier. I just feel like Poirier, when that name comes up, although he's not great at everything, he's brilliant at a lot of things. He's versatile. Chandler's not great at everything either. He's not got a special thing. Ch Chandler's great at a few things. I'd say Poirier's probably a little more well-versed a lot of things. Chandler's got that knockout power. Poirier's got that accumulation. And I just think he's way too tough for Chandler. Yeah, the size, the, the whole durability. Too dogged. Too experienced. Peace.